Now, the trucking industry employs one out of every 16 workers in the country. This week, we're showing our thanks with National Truck Driver Appreciation Week. And this morning, we're meeting an America's road team captain and the only female in a group of 20 new members is pretty cool. With the American Trucking Association, Rhonda Hartman. Good morning, Rhonda. How are you? Good morning. I'm great. How are you? Fantastic. Uh, can we just uh, get to the basics here? Why is the trucking industry uh, so important in our country? Well, we haul all essential goods. Of course, with the disasters that have happened, we are, you know, next on scene after all of the initial people get down there, you know, make sure everybody's okay. But on a daily basis, you know, all the shelves are filled by trucks. Yeah, uh, and you're a professional, uh, you're a professional driver. What do you like most about the job? I like not having a boss looking over my shoulder all the time. <laughs> you know, we just get a chance, we get a chance to get out there and, you know, work, work hard, earn a good living. That's why I like it the most. Yeah. But the impact though, I want, to, I want to touch on that for a second because the impact the trucking industry uh, has on our national economy, can you, can you talk about that? Well, I know nationally we're one in 16, but in Nebraska specifically, it's even more than that. One in 12 are actually associated with the trucking industry as far as jobs. Yeah. That, so we, we are a huge part of the economy. That's quite an impact across country and in Nebraska here, like you said. Uh, what does it take? What does it take to be a professional truck driver? Well, it takes dedication, absolutely, to whatever you're doing, no matter what your job is. Uh, with truck driving, you know, in particular, you, you've got to, you know, get out there and drive in all kinds of weather conditions, so you have to be, con you know, comfortable with that. Yeah. We've taken a road trip uh, this summer. We went out to Colorado and took the kids, and there are a lot of semis on the road. Uh, what are some I guess, what are some safety tips for motorists uh, who are sharing the roads with a lot of these professional truck drivers? Well, personally, I would like it if everybody would just slow down and be a little bit more patient with each other. People get in such a big hurry, it seems like anymore. And, you know, besides just the distracted driving, when mm -hmm. you get in too big of a hurry, you're just not paying attention. Yeah, what do you see most often uh, when you, you share the roads with with other drivers out there traveling the highways, what, what type of issues do you see most often? Well, when you're in heavy traffic, especially, which I-80 is extremely heavy traffic all the way to Colorado, mm -hmm. where you guys went on vacation, um, when they get beside me and they hang there, you know, they, they get into those blind spots where we can't see them. But even if I know they're there, they just don't move out of them. They need to just kind of hang back a little bit when they get the opportunity to move out of those places. If they can't see my face in the mirror, then I can't see them. Yeah, you got to be able to see them in the mirror. Uh, the ATA and, and others, what are they doing to honor the truck driver this week? Well, there's a lot of events going on to honor the truckers um, all across the United States. Each company has their own thing going on. But, you know, if you're out there in a business or whatever, you know, give a thumbs up to the drivers out there for doing their job this week because you can tell them thank you, too. Yeah, Rhonda, thanks for your time and, and thanks to all those other professional truck drivers out there, especially helping with some of these natural disasters going on right now, the hurricanes and uh, getting some of the relief efforts down to a lot of these areas. Rhonda, thanks for your time and, and stay safe on the roads, okay? Thank you, sir. I will. You betcha. Kelly, over to you.